already showed you how to make the easiest and tastiest meatballs ever. Now we're going to show you the world's simplest homemade pasta sauce to go with it. So I know what you're thinking. You're probably saying I am not a chef. There's no way I can make my own pasta sauce or there's no way I have the time to make my own pasta sauce. But we're about to show you that you can and it's actually really easy. So we start with a medium onion and I dice it. Um, and then you get a 28, 28 ounce can of whole peeled tomatoes. I'm just gonna add those, go ahead and add those to the pot. And then we're gonna do about four large garlic cloves whole. So you, all you have to do is peel them. I hate mincing garlic, so just peel them, put the whole oh, things in there. Easy. And then we're gonna put a teaspoon of oregano, just dried oregano, and two tablespoons of olive oil. I might not put quite two. Um, and then, and make sure one thing, make sure you have a pretty heavy bottomed pot because you're gonna be simmering it for quite a while. So I'm just gonna get it simmering and then we're gonna simmer it uh, for 45 minutes. We're gonna do a couple other things throughout, but literally I'm just gonna get it simmering, stir it a few times and uh, do some other things while, while I wait for it to cook. So that's it, that's all we gotta do right now? Yep, that's it right now. I'm gonna stir it together, but other than that, we're several minutes in to um, this simmering. So I'm just taking a potato smasher, I don't know what you call this, and um, I am just gonna smash up the tomatoes and the garlic, and I'll do this several times while it is simmering. So uh, really just wanting things to get, we don't mind a chunky tomato sauce, so uh, just want things. super thin. You need to put it in a blender. Yeah, or you can do an immersion blender, you know, things like that. But we don't mind it, so Especially I'm just gonna. It takes a little less time. I'm just going to smash it up a little bit. I'm gonna give our sauce one more little beating. I'm gonna smooth it out just a little more. And after 45 minutes, the pasta sauce is done. Again, if you want it any smoother than this, you need to use an emulsion blender or just stick it in the blender for a little bit. We're about to have some spaghetti and meatballs.